So I remember when I first received my diagnosis, the first thing I worried about the most was losing my hair, especially as a woman, and especially for someone who's, who does care about her appearance. The possibility of losing my hair, it was devastating. And being able to keep my hair, it helped me feel more normal during a time when everything is upside down. I could look in the mirror and see someone who was determined and resilient and not someone who was sick. I went to work, I went to the gym, and everyone treated me normally, um, which I think, I think that when you're dealing with something like cancer, like yeah, there's treatment, but there's also that sense of internal determination and, and you draw from that strength and being able to keep my hair was part of that. Like I said, I would look in the mirror and see someone strong who was gonna survive. And having a, a positive mindset, it's not necessarily a positive, but having a determined mindset can really make the difference when it comes to cancer and surviving cancer and getting through treatment. And I think treatment would have been a lot harder if I'd lost my hair. You know, cancer has touched uh, me personally and professionally. Uh, my mom passed away from cancer uh, and had pancreatic cancer when I was 16 years old. So I saw the devastating and felt it as a, as a child to have a parent and lose a parent at such an early age to cancer. And I know professionally my whole life, 40 years of hairdressing, um, how my guests are affected and come to me and get apprehensive about losing their hair. And that's why I believe in hair to stay. Hair to Stay has probably been the uh, easiest fundraiser for me to get engagement. You know, we did fundraising through just email blasts to my guests, uh, signage around the salon, mirror talkers, um, letting people know that we are raising money for this great cause of called cold capping. And um, with that, our success rate last year was uh, $10,000 for the month of October, which and um, I'm looking forward to beating that this year. Um, for every $1,000 we raise, we help an individual with their treatment. So I invite you to go to hairtostay.org, mm -hmm. sign up and get involved. Thank you. <laughs>